these running. These are probably the most important thing in the whole kingdom at this point in time. Everything's gonna require clay and I can't seem to keep up even with three extractors. These extractors, however, are keeping up. In fact, I'm gonna take this last one and put it inside. ready to go back outside. In fact, I'm just going to go ahead and put it outside. Empty these out really quick. Alright, so while I'm doing this, welcome back to the infected everybody. This is going to be an episode where we're going to be focusing on power yet again. But not a power circuitry. We're going to be working on power consumption. So I'm going to be putting lights up. Probably in that tower. One of these towers is going to be lit up by the end of this episode. That's the goal. I just don't know which one yet. So I think I may have misinterpreted a comment one of you made two episodes ago. And it was that we can, we might be able to put the lamp inside of this building. I know we can't put the ceiling lamp. Which is what I originally thought they said. But it appears that I was uh, mistaken. I misread it. I saw a lamp and I assumed it was this one. Go ahead and put these up since I have it. I also want to get these built as well. But the other lamp. The uh, oil lamp. So let's see if I can actually put that in here. And you can. However... You can't really put it on the ceiling. And I. Yeah, and X doesn't do anything. I can put it on the floor, though. So I stand corrected on not being able to put anything in here. I put these just on each corner. Probably overkill, but we'll see. What do we need for this? The two copper, of course. One iron ingot and one fish oil. So I'm gonna make two of them really quick. So I need four copper, two fish oil, and two iron ingots. Fish oil is not in here. One, two iron ingots, all four of these. And two fish oil, which I believe I still keep in the butcher house. Okay. Go see how this looks. Although I'm not going to be able to really tell until nightfall. It's... <sighs> it's about six hours away. So I'm gonna, it's going to be a minute before I see it. But I'm going to prepare it now. Then I'm going to work on getting these built. And then I guess that tower, since that was the first tower erected, that will be the first one that gets lit up. That. And that. Nothing else for these. So we'll see how illuminating that is. I'm not too familiar with the oil lamps. I've never really used them. Put that away. So let's get these built. Which is pretty easy to build. Get myself some more plant fiber while I'm at it. Uh, I guess I'll chop down one of these big ones. Here. All right, let's just chop this one here. I'm glad this doesn't require any kind of iron or anything to build. These, however, are a different story. So, two, four, six, six. I need eight electrical parts. And what else? One copper and three iron ingots. Of course, the glass as well. So, we'll go get all that. So, I need four copper, like 12 iron ingots. And of course the electrical parts. Oop, well, okay. I guess we're gonna do trips instead. Good wait. Looks like it's gonna storm here soon. Oop. 
Wrong button. Of course, I could have just thrown everything into a chest, but it's too late now. And yeah, of course, I also have a bunch of clay soil I need to turn into clay. I'm gonna go ahead and, and take care of one thing really quick. I'll just turn it really quick. There's no quick swap for these. I can't just right click and put it in. Unfortunately, I wish they would, especially since you have to do like the whole three pass thing. Did I turn the other one on? So we're back up to 40 again, which I'm going to go ahead and just take it because I do have some more that I need to upgrade. Yep. It'll get there. Probably by the end of this episode, I'll be done with that. So three more minutes I can come back. I'm gonna spend a little bit of time. I'm just gonna get this taken care of so I can clear up some space and then I'll put the rest of the stuff out. That doesn't sound good at all. At least I'm done. Oh shit! Okay. Guess we're doing house fights. Oh. Jesus. Okay. Oh fuck. No. All right. So that they had to have spawned inside. Maybe, may, or maybe they ran. Maybe it's because I left the damn door open. Kill myself. Oh, that was crazy. Okay. I was not expecting them to be right at the damn door. Oh, well, it was worthwhile. Got electrical parts. What is that? Really? Oh, that's not good. Okay. We're having... So they... I guess blended through the door. What is going on here? Is there an... Ah, you would destroy one. Okay. Just... Die. Alright, so I gotta steal. Freezing now. Did I kill any over here? Looks like two. Now I gotta... Okay. At least it's cheap. They're not destroying the brick. How much damage did they do, though? Ah, the stamina thing. Um... Okay, well, they didn't do too much. Does he still have his repair kits? I need to make sure he's repairing stuff. Which one did I put it in? Uh, well, since I'm here... So, trying to eat up all these potatoes because that's what I get a lot of, and it gives me protein. So, it doesn't make any sense not to eat it. And I'm not seeing so many potatoes. Actually, hold on. Grab you, you, you. And I'm gonna put you in shit. Someone made a suggestion on the forums, which I fully support. Suggested that you can assign 
different material that goes inside these chests. And that's the only thing that Michael put inside. So you can have potatoes in one, onions in another, and so on and so forth. And then he'll take the biofuel and redistribute them to a different one. Take too long. The uh, whole chest management system needs to be approved upon. Because right now it just doesn't really work. Let me get two more of those things so I can clear my inventory of these. And put that in there. Okay, let's get inside where it's warm. But even with all of this, 22 heat, I'm still taking a beating as far as temperature. Unless there's something on uh, that I'm wearing that I'm just not paying attention to. But these are the two warmest things that I, re that I recall. The food uh, clothes. I have the boots on, right? So I don't see. So that's 10, 10. Plus one, that's, I mean, that takes the place of my winter coat. I wonder if these lose, I wonder if these lose their, uh, their heat, if. Let's find out. Well, this is droid. I have 22. Take it off. It's still 22. So I guess they do lose their heat benefit. So let's just experiment a little bit. I'm gonna just grab that. What all do I need for it? Itempedia. Eight Kevlar, five cloth. I could have just grabbed eight Kevlar. And then five cloth. And I didn't see what I'm supposed to build it on, but I'm going to assume this. Nope, this. It was just. Look, but. Okay, so now I have 24. Okay, so this is damaged. Do you, uh, you lose your heat benefit? So I guess I can just destroy these. It's negative 28 durability. Are you serious? How do you repair this? Guess there is none. And now I'm hot. I don't know how this ended up back at 68. This was at zero at one point. Okay, so armor. I'll just grab all of this along with my cloth. Somewhere in here, I thought I had a bunch of different cloths. Did I actually put that in the right spot? No. I guess I'm making more. Plastics, dried brick, glass, bark chips. Where was it? Okay, well, let's see. Itempedia. Uh, so, three plant fiber, five chips. 15 plant fiber, 25 chips. So, put this in half. And then plant fiber. So, 15. Man, I'm going to have to go out there and chop some trees down. Let's split by one. Okay, so that... This is not good. Uh, yeah. If that helps. Yeah, they will. Okay, so come over here. It has to be in this that you make that. So we have 10 cloth. Now, what do I need in order to make the plant fiber? Or the armor? Itopedia. So 5 cloth and 10 Kevlar. And I need that here. Do it this way. And that provides me with an additional four. Let's take that off for now, though. And feet. What do I need for the boot? I need four and four. Got 
right? Oh, not that one. What the hell? Sixteen. Throw that one away. So what's the max now? So the max is thirty? I might be losing some with this. If I take that off. No, but I'm getting the, the full benefit. So I can go up to max 30. Of course, the storm's gone now, so I can't confirm that I can survive out in the storm. However, I at least now have max armor, which maybe there's a quick hot fix that made it to where it's useful, but I don't think it is. And I completely forgot what I needed to grab for those, those uh, lamps. So I think it was two more iron, one, two, four copper, and I guess we'll figure out what's left. I'm pretty sure it's just the electrical. I need eight of those. So the glass, that's what it was. Okay, so four glass and seven electrical parts. So the late game has a lot of repetitive action, such as restocking these. And I may very well decide to make a third one just to speed up the process. Of course, I'm hot again. Take that off. So one more. So three minutes this place will be finally finished. As far as the upgrades go, the structure. That was all of it. I don't have any more steel. But one here. I have the two wooden logs. I can turn that clay soil into clay. Um I don't need the feathers. I don't need the cloth. I don't need the nails. Technically don't need that. And mm -hmm. I don't need the aluminum. I will take the rope though for the door uh the wall outside. Restock this. And then I'm gonna make those electrical parts so that I can get those lights outside turned on. And then I'll finally be able to work on the, the tower. So. Seven. 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 Well, first two are going to drop. Or first one. Oops. Gonna need more plastic sand too. So that means that I need to officially turn Mike off of chopping trees. So I'll do just that. Because I need more plant fiber and the only way I can make plant fiber at this point in time is to chop trees myself. So, no, no log stand. Speaking of logs, go ahead and just put these away. Can't put that away. All right, oh, glass. Come on, spring. So looking forward to just planting everything really quick. No, no, glass is not here, sorry. Glass is over here. Right there, where's the glass? Alright. Street light. And street light. Right. 
Damn it, stop doing that. Street light. Alright, so now we have all our lights established. This will be the one that I have my control panel on, since I can't put it inside of the garage. So we'll go to power, control panel. Make sure to, yeah, see how you can see that on the left side there? So that means that it needs to be on the front. Make sure it's properly oriented, orientated. That looks good. Now we'll put the junction box just above, which okay, that is the right direction. That's good enough. So what do I need for this? I need four iron ingots, two copper force, two cobalt, eight screws. Okay, there's that. So this just needs one cobalt, one iron. And then while I'm in there, I'll grab some wire. And I'm going to need, let's see, one, two, three. Three, four wires, five wires. I have four already. And, oh man. Five. What was it? I think one iron and one cobalt. What do I need for the wire? I think that is... Yeah, that is copper plus oil. So we'll just split that in half. Everything's still going, right? How's my power even look? Perfect. The mat mixer and all that's going. All right. Upgrade this last one. Yay, it's done. This place looks beautiful now. Sexy house, let's close the door, it's cold. Uh, put that away. So. And one oil. I think I, I, think I just needed six. Or seven. We'll find out, we'll come back if we need to. This will be called three light. <sighs> I don't know what was going on with him. Why he was just standing there like that. What does this need? Oh, I had the sticks too. Alright, so I just need five planks for that. But that's not what I'm working on right now. This away. Street lights. Yay! Alright, so how's this look? Come on. Oh. Oh, that's interesting. Okay. Alright, so now I'm going to need to get a relay, because you can't go from one light to the next. So that makes this whole process just that much more expensive. So one copper, one iron. So I'm going to need two more. Which means I'm going to need two more wires as well. So just get rid of that. Was it two copper, two, and then two more iron or wires? Oh, I have everything. I am going to need more screws, unfortunately. Do I not have any more? I have so many nails. As expensive as this is, I need them. And I need to hurry because the sun's starting to go down, and I want to see what this looks like. But you guys do too. Okay. 
Oh, you know what? I don't need that. Grab, just delete you. How do I? How do I do that? No, I don't want to delete the street light. Yes, delete the wires. Oh, well, I don't have relays down, so I don't know what I'm doing. That there. That there. All right, one copper, one iron. Man, just these couple street lights it's sucking down a lot of my supply. So I'm I'm gonna have to make more copper extractors. I don't have a choice. Not if I wanna keep up this momentum. I guess I don't need to keep jumping. I mean, I guess I could technically put them on both sides and it would look fine. I'm trying to think. Something I always take for granted I never actually pay attention to. Are streetlights staggered? Next time I go out, I'm going to have to pay attention to that. I don't think they are. And the space that I'm going to have to figure out, I might just have to just wing it. But this looks nice. I'm going to, uh, yeah, I am going to do the other, other side, I think. I can remember where it, the hell it is. So that would be here. I'm not going to build it because I want to get to the tower, but I will put down the blueprints. And then I'll probably go as far as just building the actual holes. And then putting up the light, somehow furniture. This one will go here. Copper. Copper. That here. Yeah, you know what? I guess I'll just go ahead and build these two. I'm doing all this and I may as well. Which means I'm gonna need four more. Four more wires. One, two, three, four. Yeah, four. And I'll stem from this one here. But before I do that, what all do I need? I need glass, I know that. So glass, more... Well, this needs copper, right? Yeah, so... Just a bunch of iron. So I need seven, eight iron. I think that's what I needed there. i grab... The two glass. And I just need the four electrical parts for that. That one's made. Alright, that one's made. I have one. I don't know why I keep pulling that one out. So I'll just go straight from you. Just like that. So I need three more wires and four electrical parts. Okay. 
Okay. Ah. Uh, oh, beautiful. Gonna make for a great Kodak moment. Great light. Oh, yeah, that looks good. Random mist doesn't really do anything, but yeah, so now when I'm driving, at least this part will be lit up, I guess. So my goal is to make that travel all the way to each one of these. Probably not that. Like I said before, I'm going to remove the extractors from this cave. And I'm going to put it in this one. So it's more of a straight shot. But I'm very impressed with this. I like this. This will be fine where it's at. Okay, so back to the other agenda. So I'm sucking away 160 right now. I don't even have my refrigerators going. Or the lights in the other house. If I have my refrigerators going, water house, everything. Negative 375, so I need that to be up to last all night. But that's a challenge for another time. Right now, we need to get this tower lit up. So, I'm gonna have two lights on this floor. So let's go ahead and just put those down as I make that decision. Put one right here, and one right here. I think, I think that's good. Maybe, maybe right here would be better. We'll see. And then up here, I think you're probably just one right here on this beam. Not a very big area. I have one here. Then I go up another flight of stairs. This one will go here. Here. Or I might just do one down there. And this one, of course, already has its light. I don't know if I'm going to actually do two. I'm going to build these lights first. And then I'll worry about the power and all that and I'll probably end up putting a control panel likely on the first floor maybe right here on this wall or here probably here and I don't think I have a whole lot yeah I'm not gonna be able to get a lit up like I want but I can at least get things started Use up some of this cobalt since I've got so much of it. All right, so drop it on the floor. Oh shoot! I didn't really think this through. Hang on, put this back. I need to make more uh, plastic. Arc chips and oil. Inch worm my way over. Wish I'd shut that door, but it's too far. Okay, so I've got tons of plastic now, but most of it away. And this is why it's important to always keep your oil running. No matter what, you may think you have enough. You do not have enough. You need to keep that constantly running. Or you will find yourself in a situation where you don't have the ability to make power because you have to wait for hours of oil creation. Which, speaking of which, 22, 24, Oh. The tower light. And... Yes, I'll do this one. 
Not this one. What am I missing? So iron. Okay. Then one here. Iron is missing. Come up here. Maybe I'll just do one. When it's made, I'll move that. Get rid of this one for now. Go up here. So we're just missing iron. Just a bunch of iron. Of course, it would have helped if I had counted the iron. But I guess I'll grab until I'm max. And we'll go with that. Tower light. Tower light. Oh yeah, I forgot about this one. I may not use that one. We'll see. For light. Move this one here. And this one. Beacon. All right, so now I need to get the uh, relays done. So the relay obviously will come from here. Position it correctly. Yes. And that relay will come down to here. Which will in turn go to there, which will shoot all the way over here to this light, which I'll need to recenter. And then I'll continue to go down about here and I hide that and then that'll shoot over here to that one. Um, hmm. I suppose it'll go from there to this spot here. Figure out how to get it in here properly. I uh, would not cooperate because that's going to get and then that'll come straight down or will it crap that may not be a good spot for it great yeah I've got nothing for that so I can't so it's going to have to oh, I'm going to have to go over here Oh. Or I suppose I could just come straight across and then I'll go down. I could delete this one here. And I won't need this one here. So I'll take from that one and we'll head down. I believe it was here. We can always move it afterwards, but I'm pretty sure it was right here. And then from there, I'll just have a beeline straight across. To both of them. At some point in time, at the end game, if I'm still going through the season, I may decide to organize this so it runs along the wall and then shoots to the, the, the shortest path from the relay to the actual device itself. That way we don't have just random wires going all over the place. That's a lot of power, or not a power, a lot of resources. Resources I don't currently have. But I am going to exhaust what all I do have really quick. I was really hoping this spring would be here. It's currently February. It has been this entire episode. So I'm going to use the rest of that and just pack up the rest of this. Which means that the next coming episodes, I'm going to need to make more extractors. There's, there's no option. So let's relay there.
Relay there. There. And then, of course, I hope I don't forget where all this shit is. Not like they flash or anything. The so one copper. So oh, I'm shy by one copper. Not that it matters, because I don't have the copper to make the control panel and all that. But I can at least get it established where I want it to be. And based on this, this would be the best spot just for that. So, or would it be down here? Yeah, yeah I think it would. It would make more sense to have it down here. So, power, control panel, where it turns it backwards every time. Unless I'm mistaken. Yeah. Power. So it comes straight here and it'll shoot up. Okay, so that pretty much concludes that part. And I love how this illuminates. Oh, never mind. So yeah, one, two, three, four, five, six. So this is taking up 60 power. So I've got a little bit of time. Well, really, I don't. I'm actually out of time, but I'm going to make this really quick. So I need five planks, and then I'm going to use the uh, rope that's on me to get that out of the way. And then I'm going to be... Stuck since I'm doing all this as well. Oh, never mind. Maybe I'll do this. Come here. Dude. Ow. You are so lucky. Maybe not. Okay, you're not lucky. You're dead. So I'll go grab you first. Don't forget where you are. All right, one more to go. All that liver. And of course, I'll need to light this place up at some point. And eventually, this whole place will be bricked up. I need to finish out here. That'll be for another time, though. So it's unfortunate I didn't get as far as I would have liked, but I did get a lot done in some sense, I guess. Depending on how you look at it. I mean, the street lights take a lot of power. Or not power, but resources. See them out there. I'm gonna come over here and start working on this. I'm tired of this whole stamina keeps running out thing. Okay. Now I'm gonna have to fill these up myself. There it is. Not doing my outro, but maybe. Um, where the hell? Where did they go? Um, I don't 
don't see him in there. Oh, maybe this is it. I don't know, my sound's not turned up, so I probably just didn't hear the screen. Oh, yeah, this. Oh, stamina again. So these are very disappointing. I thought that they would illuminate a lot more than this. This is barely anything. What if I move them? Yeah. Um, this might be one of those things you just you need up. Yeah, even then it just does not illuminate. But they don't take any resources to keep lit, just like the fire pots. So it, I guess I'll just keep them lit. I suppose it does something. If you don't want this, I wonder if you can put those up there. Yeah, if you don't want power, you kind of have to stack them for whatever reason. I won't let you. I guess you could do it that way. Let's see. Let's make one more. So this one will go about here. Oh wow, I've been up all night. My guy's tired as hell. So I guess we won't be able to feel. I'll do this next episode. So, it's been way longer than I anticipated this episode to take. But, I'm glad we got the things done. Just now I need more resources. Which is a repetitive issue that I'm never going to be able to get rid of. Go ahead and this so this would be called the trenches all right well maybe i'll put the trenches down bottom maybe that'll look good Bridges. make the space there so it's consistent the trenches okay so with that said thank you for watching Please don't forget to like and subscribe. Leave a message. Let me know what you think. Any tips, tricks, or hits would be greatly appreciated. I'm the NBA King, and I'll see you in the next one.